exciting! A squirrel! Where? Where? It went behind that tree. And now it's over there. Where? Where? I can't see any squirrel. Look, Nip. A deer. Psst. Oggy, come and see. A deer. Where? Where? Oh, now it's gone. Shh. Not so loud, Oggy Bach. Was there really a deer and a squirrel? Or are you all playing tricks on me? Oh, no one's playing tricks on you, Oggy Bach. Unless the animals are, of course. <laughs> well, indeed, well, well. Come on, everyone. Walk this way. Perhaps the animals in the wood are playing tricks on me. Ah, here we diddly are. There will be some little beasts around here, I'm sure. Little beasts? Oh, no. They might play tricks on me, too. Oh, I'm not so sure about this. I wish I knew more about these little beasts we might find. There are things you need to see, so you should take a look through me. Before you go on a woodland walk, it's always a good idea to remember the rules. So, what do we have to remember in forest school? Don't touch stigadettles, don't touch barbos. Yeah, we have to be careful. What's another rule? Diana? No running. Good girl. We always use our walking feet, don't we, in forest school? OK, Joshua? Don't put anything in your mouth. Well remembered. Nothing in our mouth? Well done for remembering the rules. Uh, what are they doing now? Well, the children have got cards of what they're going to be looking for. Look, he's got a picture of a spider and a snail. Can anybody remember what we call all these little creatures? Mini beasts. Mini beasts. And because they're animals, we're going to have to be very careful with them. The children are going to be looking for different kinds of mini beasts, and they're using special bug boxes so they can see the bugs really clearly. Oh, that's so cool! Look under. Oh, look! A wriggly worm! Wriggle, wriggle, wriggle! <laughs> oh, look at that snail! I, I love snails! And a beetle, too! They're having so much fun, and the mini beasts aren't playing tricks on the children at all! Oh! What are they doing now? The children are lying under a table that has special magnifying glass so they can see the bugs better. Wicked! Can you see what the snail is leaving behind it? No. Uh, that snail hasn't got any legs at all! That's right. He's got... Yeah. Ooh, he's got some. But I can't count them because they're so skinny. <laughs> skinny little legs. <laughs> Very carefully. What do we need? Oh, look, a lovely ladybird. Are they putting them back now? Yes, it's really important to put the mini beasts back where they came from. So the mini beasts here can have some peace and quiet. And it's also very important to wash your hands after you've been playing outside. Wash your hands nice and clean so they can all have a bombastic stack of Welsh kicks. <laughs> Now I've shown you what to do, so the rest is up to you. Those little beasts, or mini beasts, look very interesting and friendly. I'm sure they won't play tricks on me. Hmm. I wonder if the others have found any. Come and see the mini beasts, Oggy. Oh, a spider! I think I'd like to be a spider. Me! Yes, everybody, it's me! <laughs> and there's a ladybird. It's only little, but if you use the magnifying glass, it will look much bigger. Bob and Tusty 
favorite color, red. That's one of my favorites. I think I'd like to be a ladybird with lots of spots. And I think I'd like to be a snail with a silvery trail. <laughs> Well, do well, well. Time to go diddly home, everyone. Oh, oh. Already? already? Thanks for bringing us to the woodland, Fireman Prout. Yes, we've had a bobbintastic time. Thankity, thank you. If we're quiet, perhaps we'll see the squirrel and the deer again, Fringebach. I just love walking in the woods. Yes, indeedy, I diddly do. Me too. It's so, so green. My favourite colour. Oh, a deer. Oh, and a squirrel. Poppintastic. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go for a walk in the woodland. Let's go for a walk in the woodland and see what might be there. But remember, the woodland is a special place, so treat it with respect and care. Yes, indeed. There are wonderful plants and flowers to see. They grow in all around. Diddly, don't pick them or take them home. Enjoy them blooming in the ground. If you listen carefully, Fringeba, you might hear the song of a bird. Don't, don't, don't shout. Be quiet. And then the sounds of the woodland can be heard. There are lots of animals living in the woods. They like to play peek-a-boo. <laughs> Squirrels scattering from tree to tree. And you might see a deer, too. My Bob and Tastic favourites are mini beasts. Look carefully and you might find them. A ladybird. A spider. Or even a snail. Yes, mini beasts of every kind. Let's go for a walk in the woodland and see what might be there. But remember, the woodland is a special place, so treat it with respect and care. 